Hey guys, what's good? Mike here. Thanks for tuning in to another video. Quick tip I want to give you when you're working on personal projects and how to utilize every little ounce of your your schedule, your daily schedule, your time. Okay, time is money. Um, especially if you're busy, um, you have a family, uh, you have a million things to do. Um, something that I do a lot, um, I'm working on a personal project right now and personal projects are vital to our growth, um, to our portfolio, to landing a job and things like that. And um, instead of just putting in, we can all design user interfaces, right? We can design quick stuff just to kind of get stuff out there. Um, but a lot of times you don't want to do that. Why? Because uh, I, was in a, I was in an interview once where if you're in an interview where somebody is actually knowledgeable in the UI UX design game, they'll kind of pick your brain and to ask you, your deeper thoughts into why you design something this way or uh, like for one one example I had I was showing a, a, a site and one of the guys called out um, a situation and said why didn't you have that button or why didn't you have that option for the user on the home page and I was like wow damn good 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 question I didn't really have an answer for him you know so you know I didn't think think to think about that but um, if I had enough time I would have thought through that so when you're working on personal projects uh, you really want to think through all the task flows, all the use cases. So, for example, if you're designing an app, I'm designing an app right now where on the opening screen, there's many there's many different variations on what you could possibly see on that home screen. And that requires a lot of time for me to sit down at my desk at home or on the couch or where, whatever and really think through this stuff. I'm talking about more than just 30 minutes, more than an hour, right? It takes time. And I don't have a lot of time to to do this. I don't have, I have, I mean, I, mean, I had, I spent three hours yesterday coaching baseball with my son. My daughter's in cheerleading. I helped my wife with all her digital marketing for her real estate business. Um, and, you know, we're searching for properties, uh, I'm, I'm working on, I have a Laker Talk vlog that I do. I have this vlog that I do. I'm working on a, a project for an online course. Um, amongst million, I'm working on this other project, like the Shark Tank pro, pro, product. Uh, I call it a Shark Tank product because it's a physical product that one day I would, it, I, I imagine myself on Shark Tank. Um, uh, I mean, the list goes on and on and on and on, right? Take out the trash, the dog, I had to take the dog to the vet, all, a million things. Point here is, I just pulled up to the parking lot, I'm about to go up to my office at work. Getting here is about a 35 minute drive. What I do sometimes, I take a notepad like this and, and I just have, you can't really see it, but there's a sketch of the interface of the of the home screen on the app there's just a, a basic like chicken scratch right and what I do is instead of like I don't look at my my notebook while I'm driving per se but every now and then I'll pick it up and I'll just glance at it and what I'm doing is as I'm driving to work I'm going through all the edge cases all the edge cases and all the task flows all the users user use cases that could possibly enter into this home screen and every now and now and then you know like when I have a second, I'll jot down something quickly. And I'm not, not while I'm driving, I'm not fully focused on my notepad, if you if you know what I mean. But having it out on my lap, having it um, sitting next to me, what it does, it it helps me focus like my attention on this is the priority for the next 30 minutes, 35 minutes while I'm driving to work. I want to be focusing on that. And then so what happens is I jotted down a few things. Um, I've gone through a few use cases and it was very helpful for me to do that basically utilize my time while I'm driving to work right so I'm driving to work I'm working on this project I have this thing on my lap and basically it just when you're when you're flushing out a project and you have different screens just take down just, just draw boxes of the different screens and sit sit it on your lap when you're um, you know riding on a bus maybe you're at the gym you're on a treadmill have it up on the actual treadmill by the TV and all that stuff and just as you go and you go through something just jot down a little little nugget or two that pertains to that particular use flow that use case whatever and um, it's kind of like that example I, I give like the um, 
you know, think of that construction site, right? That construction worker just hammering in a little nail. It chips away at those little bits, and then as I get home by the day, I'm going to do it again when I'm when I'm eating some lunch or whatnot. I'm going to try to finish up this particular collection of, of use cases on this home screen, and hopefully, you know, what it, what happens is now I can work on another s section of the site when I get home and, and, and so forth. And the point here is just utilize your time. Don't waste your time. Time is money. Every little aspect of your day, try to focus on certain things and utilize any little free, free time you have to chip away at, at projects you may have. Because it's vital when you're, like I said, for this particular case, for a personal project, it's easy for me to just design anything. But you want to, when you show, showcase a personal project in an interview or whatnot, they're going to ask you your thoughts on why you come up with this particular use case. And they may have examples of different use cases that you've missed. So it's your job to kind of go through that and give this some thought. But don't sit around at home four hours just thinking about, man, you know, all the different use cases. When you're out and about, when your kid's out in the park, take your notebook, notebook and jot stuff down. You know, anyway, that's my thoughts. Hopefully you earned a nugget or two from this. Thanks for watching, commenting, and liking the video. And hit me up on my website, mlfco.com. If you have any questions, we'll talk to some guys. Peace.